These black twins were separated in infancy. Look what they're like 20 years later. Eamon and Sanchia, two sisters whose lives began under extraordinary circumstances in Birmingham. Their arrival into the world was marked not only by its premature nature, but also by a rare medical condition. They were conjoined at the spine. This unexpected revelation set the stage for a story of resilience and profound emotional depth. From the moment of their birth, the medical complexities surrounding Eamon and Sanchia were immense. The medical team faced the daunting task of caring for these fragile infants who had entered the world four months earlier than anticipated. The fact that their spines were fused together presented an array of medical challenges, requiring a level of care and expertise that went far beyond the norm. This situation was not just a medical anomaly. It was a journey into uncharted territory for both the medical professionals and the family. The parents of Eamon and Sanchia found themselves thrust into a world of uncertainty and fear. Their emotional journey began with the shock and disbelief that often accompanies such unforeseen circumstances. The joy of welcoming their daughters was intertwined with the apprehension about their health and future. They grappled with a plethora of emotions, hope, despair, love, and the overwhelming desire to protect their newborns against all odds. The parents' experience was a testament to the strength and resilience inherent in the human spirit when faced with life's most challenging moments. As the days passed, the reality of Eamon and Sanchia's condition began to sink in. The parents navigated through a maze of medical consultations, each bringing its own set of information, prognosis, and plans for the future. They found themselves having to make critical decisions, weighing the risks and benefits of various medical interventions, all while trying to maintain a sense of normalcy in their lives. The dilemma of how best to care for their daughters was a constant companion, a question that loomed large in every conversation and decision. The story of Eamon and Sanchia is also a story of the incredible bond between parents and their children. It's a narrative that delves deep into the heart of what it means to love unconditionally. The parents' unwavering commitment to their daughter's well-being, despite the odds stacked against them, is a powerful portrayal of parental love and sacrifice. Their journey was not just about dealing with a medical condition. It was about nurturing, protecting, and loving their children in the face of adversity. Throughout this ordeal, the broader community, including family members, friends, and medical professionals, played a pivotal role. They provided support, comfort, and encouragement, helping the family navigate through the complexities of the situation. The shared experiences of joy, worry, and hope forged a bond among everyone involved, creating a network of care that surrounded Eamon and Sanchia with love and support. In essence, this part of the story is a vivid tapestry of human emotions, medical challenges, and the unbreakable bonds of family. It's a testament to the resilience of the human spirit and the extraordinary measures parents will take to ensure the well-being of their children. The tale of Eamon and Sanchia's early days is not just about their unique medical condition. It's a narrative about hope, love, and the enduring strength of family ties in the face of overwhelming challenges. The segment of Eamon and Sanchia's story that centers on their monumental surgery unfolds with a blend of medical precision, emotional depth, and national significance. This phase in their lives marked a turning point, not only for them, but for the medical community and the wider public who followed their journey with bated breath. The operation to separate the twins was a marvel of medical expertise and innovation, a team of skilled surgeons, anesthetists, and nurses came together, each playing a crucial role in this intricate procedure. The complexity of the surgery cannot be overstated. It involved delicately separating the spines of two tiny premature infants, a procedure fraught with risks and unknowns. The medical team prepared extensively, mapping out every possible scenario, knowing that every decision, every incision, would be critical to the twins' survival and future quality of life. As news of the surgery spread, it captured the nation's attention. This was more than just a medical procedure. It was a story of human resilience and scientific advancement. 
The public's fascination was a mix of awe at the medical team's bravery and concern for the welfare of Eamon and Sanchia. Media outlets across the country covered the story, eagerly awaiting updates and sharing the family's journey with millions of people. The operation became a symbol of hope and a testament to the wonders of modern medicine. In the immediate aftermath of the surgery, the focus shifted to the twins' recovery. The initial relief of the successful separation was quickly tempered by the reality of the recovery process. Eamon and Sanchia faced a challenging path ahead, filled with intensive care and close monitoring. The post-operative period was a critical time as the medical team worked tirelessly to manage pain, prevent infections, and facilitate healing. The twins' resilience during this time was remarkable, a testament to their strength and the care they received. For the family, the surgery and its aftermath were a whirlwind of emotions. There was immense gratitude for the medical team's skill and dedication, coupled with anxiety about the twins' recovery. The family found themselves in a liminal space, caught between the joy of the successful separation and the uncertainties of the future. They were constantly at the hospital, providing love and support, while also trying to process the enormity of what had happened. The impact of the surgery extended beyond the immediate medical outcomes. It brought about a profound change in the family dynamics. The parents who had once cared for conjoined twins now had to adapt to the reality of raising two separate individuals, each with their own needs and challenges. This period was one of adjustment and learning, as the family navigated this new chapter in their lives. This portion of Eamon and Sanchia's story is a compelling narrative of medical achievement, family resilience, and public engagement. It highlights the extraordinary efforts of the medical team, the complexities of a rare and risky surgery, and the emotional roller coaster experienced by the family and the nation. The twin surgery was not just a medical milestone, it was a journey of hope, courage, and the unyielding spirit of two young girls and their family. The story of Eamon and Sanchia post-surgery is a compelling narrative of growth, individuality, and resilience. After their separation, the twins embarked on distinct paths, each carving out her own identity while navigating the challenges and opportunities that came their way. As they grew older, Eamon and Sanchia's lives diverged in terms of interest and academic pursuits, yet their bond remained a constant, unbreakable thread. Eamon, showing an early inclination towards social sciences, veered into the world of politics. Her journey was marked by a keen interest in public affairs, a passion for understanding societal structures, and a desire to contribute positively to her community. This path led her to pursue studies in political science, where she thrived, driven by her curiosity and determination to make a difference. Sanchia, on the other hand, was drawn to the logical and precise world of technology. Her choice to study programming was a reflection of her methodical thought process and her fascination with the endless possibilities of technology. In her academic endeavors, Sanchia displayed a remarkable aptitude for coding and software development, skills that promised a future of innovation and creativity. Despite their different academic and personal interests, Eamon and Sanchia maintained a deep connection. Their shared experiences from their unique birth to the life-altering surgery forged a bond that was as emotional as it was unspoken. They supported each other's aspirations and celebrated each other's achievements, embodying the essence of sisterhood. The twins' journey was not without its challenges. They both faced the physical and emotional aftermath of their surgery, which included regular medical checkups and a need for ongoing physical therapy. These challenges, however, did not define them. Instead, they served as a backdrop against which Eamon and Sanchia's resilience and strength were prominently displayed. They adapted to their circumstances with grace and determination, refusing to be limited by the physical reminders of their past. Their family played a pivotal role in their development. Parents and siblings provided an environment of love and encouragement, fostering a sense of normalcy and belonging. 
This support system was instrumental in helping Eamon and Sanchia navigate the complexities of growing up with a unique medical history. It also helped them in developing a strong sense of self and the confidence to pursue their individual goals. As they matured, Eamon and Sanchia became symbols of hope and perseverance. Their story resonated with many who saw in them the embodiment of overcoming adversity. The twins' journey was a reminder that while life can be unpredictable and challenging, it is also filled with opportunities for growth and self-discovery. In the essence, the post-surgery lives of Eamon and Sanchia are a testament to the power of the human spirit. Their individual developments, set against the backdrop of their shared history, highlight the complex interplay between personal identity and deep familial bonds. Their story is not just about the challenges they faced, but also about the triumph of determination, the importance of support, and the enduring strength of sisterly love. The concluding segment of Eamon and Sanchia's narrative is a reflective and introspective exploration of their lives, offering a window into their inner thoughts and feelings about their extraordinary journey. This part of their story delves deep into their personal reflections, revealing how they've come to terms with their unique past and the physical challenges that have been an integral part of their lives. Eamon and Sanchia, now further along in their journey of life, look back on their experiences with a mix of emotions. There is a sense of gratitude for the medical advances and the skilled professionals who made their separation possible a feeling intermingled with an awareness of the complexities and difficulties they've faced since. They acknowledge the physical challenges that have been a constant companion since their surgery, the ongoing medical appointments, the need for physical therapy, and the adjustments they've had to make in their daily lives. Yet there's an undercurrent of resilience in their reflections, a testament to their strength and adaptability. Their story, having garnered significant public attention, has placed them in a unique position. Eamon and Sanchia expressed mixed feelings about the public's curiosity and the media spotlight that is often shown on them. While they understand the fascination with their story, they also crave normalcy and the freedom to live their lives without the constant gaze of public interest. Their perspective on being conjoined twins who were successfully separated is nuanced. They see it as a defining part of their identity, but not the sole aspect that characterizes who they are. This duality of being public figures and yet ordinary individuals with personal aspirations and dreams is a theme that resonates throughout their reflections. The twins also ponder the concept of identity and individuality, particularly poignant given their start in life as conjoined twins. They discuss how their separation allowed them the opportunity to develop as individuals, each with her own set of interests, goals, and viewpoints. This separation, while physical, also symbolized a journey towards personal autonomy and self-discovery. Eamon and Sanchia appreciate the distinct paths they've carved out for themselves, celebrating their individual achievements and personal growth. Despite these individual paths, the bond between Eamon and Sanchia remains a central and unbreakable element of their story. They talk about the deep connection they share, a bond forged through shared experiences, and a unique understanding of each other's lives. This bond is not just a remnant of their past as conjoined twins, it's a living, evolving connection that continues to play a significant role in their lives. In reflecting on their journey, Eamon and Sanchia convey a sense of acceptance and peace with their past. They've navigated the challenges and triumphs with grace and fortitude, learning to embrace their story as part of their identity. Their reflections offer insights into the human spirit's capacity for resilience, the complexity of navigating life marked by such a unique beginning, and the enduring power of familial bonds and personal perseverance. In summary, this final reflection is a poignant and insightful look into Eamon and Sanchia's inner worlds. It captures the essence of their journey, a tale of overcoming, growing, and finding strength in both individuality and togetherness. Their story is a powerful narrative about the multifaceted nature of the human life, the challenges we face, and the incredible capacity for adaptation and growth.